Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Rawr, rawr, rawr. What's up everybody? East Philly here. <clears throat> I might be making this video twice. Uh, I had a lot of wind noise earlier, so I'm trying to figure out what the problem is. And right now, it seems it could be one of three things. One was the, one of the wind deflector sock things on my microphone had fallen off a bit and the microphone wasn't really placed right. That might have been it. Two is the USB to microphone adapter wasn't might not have completely be in the GoPro. And three is uh, the USB to microphone adapter may have broke. That's the new one I just bought. And for some reason, I guess the way I had my wires all set up, it just didn't fit in the port correctly. Or it fit in the port correctly, but it pulled on the wire and the metal part of the uh, mini USB adapter uh, started to pull out of the housing. So I don't know if the wires are messed up. Either way, I'm going to go to Best Buy right now and buy a new adapter. Uh, back to the regular idea. So I have a list here of people. Uh, since I'm going to be in Maine for, I won't have content up for about a week probably, unless I get the scheduling done right and I actually do some work, which I have to make myself do. So here's a couple people, mostly local people, that uh, are also moto vloggers, and I'm going to talk a little bit about each of them, if I know that much about them, and we'll just some people for you to check out and see if you like their content check them out maybe subscribe like their videos if you like them or whatever so it's just something a little different uh, uh, so yeah i'm going to talk about them check out their channels their videos see if you like them uh, first up is six foot bmx he's not a photo vlogger he is a bmx vlogger uh, I don't believe he has a camera yet. He's working on that. He plans on making some videos very soon. Uh, and he'll have content out. Uh, I plan on meeting up with him at some point And uh, doing some videos. Just hanging out. Or uh, maybe I'll, we'll meet up at one of the skate parks. And I'll film some videos for him. We'll see how that goes. Uh, 77 TikTok. You'll notice these are in alphabetical order. Uh... I did a pseudo dual vlog with 77 TikTok uh, last week. Uh, we had fun, hung out for a while, went on the mailbox ride that a lot of the Philly riders do. Uh, we've been talking about a bunch of different collab stuff and hanging out, as well as trying to get a lot of the Philly vloggers out for some meetups and different stuff like that. Next up is Broad Street Hooligan. I don't believe he has any videos yet. I think he just has a channel right now for watching other moto vloggers in Philly. Uh, I've only really talked to him in passing when it came to uh, watching some videos. And uh, I'm not sure if he's interested in moto vlogging or not, but uh, just keep an eye on his channel. And you'll definitely see them in some of me or 77 TikToks videos in the future once we all get out riding together. What, what else is there? There, Duncan Kane. Duncan Kane is a UK moto vlogger. Uh, I don't know if he has a, a specific moto vlogging setup yet. Uh, he's working on getting a bike now that he's moved to the US. And uh, he lives near me apparently, so we're gonna definitely meet up and hang out and do some riding. And uh, I don't know if we're going to have dual vlogs, like I said, I don't really know if he has any vlogging equipment in terms of like a helmet camera and stuff like that. He has a couple videos of his bike in the UK, and I believe he sold that right before he left, and he 
lives here now. So we'll definitely be meeting up with him at some point. There's Moto Morgan. Moto Morgan has a few videos, but they were all from a few months ago, so I don't know if he slash she still puts videos up. I believe it's a dude. Uh, but he did have content for a good while, just nothing too recent. Octane Moto. I have no clue what his ideas are for moto vlogging. Uh, he kind of just makes stuff, uh, whether it's music or content or writing. He has a bunch of different fields that he does, which is typical for some most YouTubers, I guess, that haven't really started doing specific things yet. Uh, Octane Moto, the Happy Rider. He's uh, he's from Canada. He does a lot of content. Uh, I think he does one or two videos a week. Uh, he's a cool guy. I watched a few of his videos. I found him through 77 TikToks videos. And he has he has good content. I like it. Uh, like like his name, the Happy Rider is. He generally does some more upbeat stuff. And it's pretty fun to watch. Let's see if I can move this up. I'm almost where I'm going. Who else? Uh, Renegade Biker 24. He is from southern U.S. Uh, he's the southern east coast area. <clears throat> I forget where exactly at the moment. Uh, he's pretty cool. He found me through some video and was talking to me and uh, got me. He's actually one of the people that kind of got me doing moto vlogs a little bit more. He was complimenting some of my videos and talking to me about videos and it kind of got me wanting to go out and do more videos. Uh, he does a lot of uh, charity rides and big group rides and I think he planned some of them. I don't know. That's, it seemed like he was talking about planning some of them. As well he does moto vlogger spotlights. So if you are interested in learning about new moto vloggers definitely check him out because he does really good content on them and he kind of talks about what their videos are about goes more in depth uh, a lot more in depth than what I'm doing with this video but he's a really cool guy uh, I have a video that I still haven't put together for him that I made for him it wasn't a moto vlog it was a uh, historical Philly, Philly vlog and I'll be putting that together at some point if I get myself to do it I'm going to try to do it within the next couple days as one of my videos for while I'm away. Uh, Zuka, Z-H-U-U-K-A, is another Philly rider. Uh, doesn't look like he put out too much content recently, uh, but he does put out a good amount of content, and it's usually just like random stuff, kind of like mine. Uh, he's probably a little bit better at keeping on track than I am, but definitely check out Zuka's stuff. Uh, I was talking to him, I think I found him through Reddit, and then I realized he was a Philly guy. So we started talking a bit, and he's one of the guys that I definitely want to meet up with. I think he rides a, uh, as far as I remember, he rode a Ninja 250 or something like that. He might have got a bigger bike since then. And this guy is not a moto vlogger, he's a firearms vlog. So he talks about firearms which you've also seen me do sometimes. And I started talking with him, another Philly guy, the Great Arms Channel, G-R-A-Y-T, that's his last name. He talks about all that in his videos. He actually says his name, so it's not like I'm just outing him here. Uh, he does some good firearms content, so check him out. You will most likely be seeing some content from both of us in the future after we meet up and go shooting and do some things like that. Uh, like I said, most of these guys I plan on meeting at some point, or have met. I've only met 77 TikTok so far, though. Uh, and most of them are local Philly guys, uh, but a few of them are not. They're just uh, smaller YouTube moto vlogging or vlogging in general uh, channels. Check them out. And if you have anybody you think I should check out, let me know. Uh, 
friends or family of yours that you think are up and coming and you want to help them get some more subscribers I'm always up for seeing more content like I said I've before this month I was laid up in bed for five months and you couldn't do much besides watch YouTube and do some stuff at home so definitely been getting into more other channels and talking to people and learning who they are meeting up with them but I won't make this go any longer than it has been I'm going to Best Buy to get a new connector just to have as a spare in case this one fails and I might actually use that one on the way back just to double check if it was this connector or not so I'll see you on a little bit well not really this is by uh, if if this one winds up not working because of wind noise I'll use that one and I'm actually going to redo this whole video if the second part of the video winds up being shorter and a little bit better I'm going to use that anyway so that's that bye bye